Tonight I'd like to tell you some of the funniest Korean jokes. <웃음> 옛날에 봉이 김선달이라는 삶에 살았는데 말이야. I got another one. 봉이 김선달 이런 사람이 Popular Korean American comedian Johnny Yoon, whose Korean name is Yoon Jong Sung, passed away in LA on March 8th last week. Johnny Yoon was a Korean comedian and an actor who became famous in America with his appearance on the show Tonight starring Johnny Carson 34 times back in the 1970s and 80s. He was born and raised in Seoul and moved to the U.S. to attend university. After graduating from Wesleyan University in Ohio, he started working in America as the first Asian to be on a local stand-up comedy show. He was first discovered in the Santa Monica Comedy Club by talent scouts from The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson at a time when Carson's approval could launch a comedian overnight. During this time, American audiences did not have much knowledge of Asian culture, which makes Johnny Yoon become the first America's most visible Asian comedian. He drew attention of many white audiences with explicit discussion of race-based humor also making sexual and political comments as a material to entertain the audience. Hello. <laughs> I'm a comedian from Korea, and I've been telling American jokes. Tonight, I'd like to tell you some of the funniest Korean jokes. I got another one. Actually, I'm, I'm half Korean, half Japanese. They call me Kojep. But I was born in Korea, South. I take no chances. He also acted in a number of films. He appeared in the movie They Call Me Bruce. And later on, he appeared in his own special on NBC. He hosted the Johnny Yoon special show back in his home country, South Korea. This show was the first American-style talk show in our country from 1898 and it lasted for a year. Before death, he was under treatment after cerebral hemorrhage for four years. Followed by this disease, he was diagnosed with dementia and was hospitalized.